Hi. Uh, this week's module is um, the Federal Reserve. Uh, the Federal Reserve is sort of the backbone of our U.S. economy and is the backbone for many uh, sophisticated um, economies around the world. As are many things you can think about, uh, the Federal Reserve are mechanics of the economy. Ideally, the economy runs naturally, um, as economists would have, have us think. Um, but d there's definitely crises that happen all the time, and the Fed tries to tweak things um, as a mechanic would do with your car. It's running too hot, running too slow. Uh, more recently, particularly from 2008 and earlier in the 90s, there have been some financial crises that have occurred. The Federal Reserve has used some of the tools in their toolkit um, to attempt to moderate and fix even the economy. The crisis of 2008 was quite severe. And um, really, after you watch the video for this week um, that I'll have you watch from PBS, I think you will walk away kind of like with your eyes open how close we were uh, to a total collapse of our U.S. financial system, which arguably would have brought down the world. Um, the reasons for the crises are multiple. Um, we could probably spend three weeks on talking about that. But anyways, I think this crisis, exploring it, will have us walk away at the end of this module, understanding the role of Federal Reserve and the new and expanding roles of Federal Reserve as we sit here right now in November of 2020, um, we're in the midst of a COVID crisis that we've never experienced anything like this before. And the role of the Fed is almost maxed out at this point. They have done some, some very um, unprecedented actions. And now they're looking for more fiscal um, and, and um, political things to be done, um, similar to in 20, 2008 where the federal government did uh, pass the bill called the TARP bill. So you had a, you had a fiscal, uh, that counts as sort of a fiscal idea, legislative, in addition to some of the things the, the Federal Reserve did in the tool. So this week, um, you watch that video, um, you look at the deck, watch the deck. It's also on VoiceThread. There's a Quizlet um, on some of the terminologies, which are important to understand. Probably a lot of them are new to you. Questions from the book and a quiz. Um, the quiz will cover um, the video. And again, I, I don't think it'll be heavy lift for the video. It's uh, PBS um, does. It's called Frontline. They do a very nice job with covering that. And in the in this week's in the portal, I actually highlight a couple of other um, movies and books. Um, that if you're interested in this, you might really uh, enjoy. They're very entertaining. One's called The Big Short by Michael Lewis. A very good movie, very good book. And the other one is um, called Too Big to Fail, um, written um, by a gentleman from MSNBC, not MSNBC, NBC, and a great movie, all these Hollywood actors and dramatized uh, using some really good uh, actors um, this crisis, which there's times when you really, it's, even though it's a drama movie, it all really happens. And um, you'll see that in the front line. So I hope you, we, at the end of this week, we walk away with a good understanding of the backdrop, what's QE and what's QE2 and um, some of the, some of the uh, verbiage that came out of this time. Hopefully you'll, you'll have that.